Welcome back, people. Okay, so this update was really unexpected. Oh, yes, we got some great news for you guys here today. Yeah, did not expect this update. So, um, we got a new update. This summer update. Release notes patch 3.72. I'm going to show you the update. Now, I did say I was going to play PS4 today, and I did promise that. And I have now broken my promise. But when these updates come, if I say I'm ever going to play the console and an update comes out, because the updates always come out first on PC. So if an update comes out and I say I'm going to play PS4, I have to do, I don't really have a choice. I, well, I do have a choice. But, <laughs> but if I want to make good content and keep showing you new updates, I do have to, I do have to come on and try and show you the update quick. How's it going, Pulse? Good to see you. How's it going, Alex? Can't stay for long. No worries, man. Thanks for dropping by. So, yeah, we were talking about updates coming. And now there has actually been an update today. And I'm very, very surprised with this. I am. There's quite a bit of stuff in this update as well. So, um, thanks for dropping likes already, people. I appreciate you guys. So, yeah, I am definitely going to get on PS4. I am sorry that I'm not playing PS4 today. But, you know, when these updates come out, I have to show it as quick as I can. Because if I don't... And then I'm not a man of my word. I know I said I promised to do the PS4, but yeah, I have to I have to show you this quick because otherwise other people are going to show it and you guys ain't going to know. I always say when them new updates come out, I try and show you them updates as quick as I possibly can. So here we go. Release no 3.7.2 summer update. Hello anglers. Welcome to the summer with our summer update full of new useful improvements so hopefully maybe not as many game bugs so that could be a good thing including let's get it polaroid glasses more contrast and lens eye strain when fishing oh yes <laughs> that's what i've been looking forward to i thought that was actually going to come at the end of september with the uh with the new lake but it turns out here it is so Uh, yeah, if you don't mind saying, yeah, if you don't mind keeping it to yourself, because I have no idea about this update yet. Thank you, man. So, uh, yeah, summer update. Polaroid glasses, as I said, they were going to, I did say they were going to bring three pairs. And they have brought three pairs. Sliders. So, they're definitely new. Um, wagglers, they're new. Hmm. Okay, so they might actually... We've, oh, wow, that's that's going to be really different. I don't know what button it's going to be, but that's really di different. Anyway, so chat control is more understandable. Chat filter added. Minimize chat icon added. Friends icon added. Auto save the last 100 messages in your friend's chat. Don't know why you'd want that, but hey, that's it's good that it's an option, I suppose. Change nickname function added. Now you can change your in-game name by yourself. For the first time which I oh okay for free I was gonna say I did change mine before um, and I paid bait coins so now it's free <laughs> but oh well that's okay I guess that's a good thing now all your records in top players and top fish categories will be updated with minimal delay so you don't have to wait so long to get onto the leaderboard but this is very interesting um, I, I can't wait to see this um, catch you later Alex man Thanks for dropping by. So, third person model emanation improved. Is that going to be like when you turn the camera or is that going to be so you can actually see a guy fishing? Probably going to be when you turn the camera, I would have thought. It would be it would have been good if you could have seen the guy holding the rod fishing, but I don't know. We'll see. Display the leader length in 3D added as well. Display a leader zoom added. FPS increased up to 80. So that's really good because it was only, I think it was, it was what was it? Was it 60 or 75 it let you go up to? Mine normally runs 75, so. 80% added the ability to change competitions with the 15th of September. Added new conditions for quality fish catch. I'm not sure what that's going to be. Added new ability to hear other motorboat sounds. That could be... I don't know if that's going to be a good thing or bad. <laughs> Sport emanations during the line pulling by fish added. So, 
I'm not sure about them last couple. But anyway, it's time. It's time we get in. They could have added a few other things. We don't know. I've already done the update. I downloaded it as we were getting the stream set up. I was going to start an earlier stream again today, like I did yesterday, but... Um, <clears throat> yeah, I was a little busy, so I didn't, I didn't get a chance to do that. Well, actually, that's me lying. I can't, I, I can't lie. <laughs> I did, I didn't want to stream earlier because we had a lot of trolls yesterday. We had a lot of people trolling and um, a lot of people saying some silly things. So, yeah. Okay, so the loading's definitely different. The bar's at the bottom now, rather than in the center. So that's one thing I noticed straight away. You have a recommendation for a game. What's the recommendation? Yeah, you get that. Oh, you can buy that for 175 bait coins. So I'm just quickly reading that. I don't think it's worth, really worth it, to be honest. Sunglasses and credit at a bargain price. Enjoy the update and get ready for the next fishing victory. Okay. All right, let's back out of this lake then. We're back out of here and we'll have a look at the new stuff they've added. It's called Rainbow Six Siege. I used to play a lot of Tom Clancy's back in the day. It was really good, actually. Really did like it. At the minute, there's not really any point in me um, getting any other game at the minute because we've got some the new Project Cars 3. we got that to show. Uh, we've also got... Um, we got the new Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 1 and 2. That's very soon as well. That possibly we could we could end up bringing some Tom Clancy's at some point. Okay, for some reason the chat is stuck down there on my right now. How can I remove that? Or is it just glitched? Open chat, close chat. Oh, there you go. So you can actually open the global chat. Wow. That's really, that's really, I don't know if that's a good thing or not. People could say some crazy things there. But it's good that we are able to hide it though. So that's, I guess that's not too bad. Alright. Let's have a look. I don't see anything, any new map. But I'm just, I just wanted to check. Just in case. No, there isn't. Alright, so let's jump into the shop. Let's have a look in the shop. I don't, they didn't mention rods. But anytime they do updates, sometimes they do miss the odd thing out here and there. So I like to quickly scroll through just in case anything was added that wasn't mentioned and whenever something new is added we'll see a yellow star there so no new rods no new reels which he didn't mention that but as i said it's always good for us to quickly check that anyway Just quickly scroll through the lines okay nothing there okay so tools and equipment this is where it's bit there you go Oh wow, it costs bait coins, man. It costs bait coins. Uh, no, I spend my real cash as it is on bait coins, man. To jump forward the next day. If I buy, if I buy, I'm gonna have to buy them just to show how how good they work. But it looks like I might have to spend some money. You always enjoyed Tom Clancy's as well. I used to be a big fan of Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege, uh, Vegas, sorry. Rainbow Six, Ve uh, Vegas, no, Tom Clancy's Vegas too. You could do like a, a, a mission called Manhunt. Used to love that. As again, Trippy, good to see you dropping by, man. I've always liked Tom Clancy's as well. All right, so new Polaroid glasses. I'm very surprised they brought those now because they did say they, they were going to be in the update for the new map but 
I'm glad that they're they're early. So anyone who is new, it's definitely worth hitting subscribe and turning notifications on when them new updates do come out. We try and show you that update as quick as we possibly can. Most of the time it's a live stream how it is. Now, if it's a new map, it'll be a live stream and we do make separate videos on missions. All of that kind of good stuff. Okay, so it looks like just the sunglasses here. I don't know what sunglasses to buy. Like, if I spend too much... if I, I want to get the best ones, but if I get the best ones... I ain't going to have many bait coins left. And then if I don't have many bait coins, I'm then going to have to buy some with real cash. i got to have... I've always got to have bait coins to keep the streams entertaining. So we keep on catching at a fast pace. So They remastered it on Xbox, I think, did they? Okay, let's read. Okay, so one is grey, which is the one that's the cheapest. Well, then one is brown. They're both, they're all plastic materials. That one says plastic. That one says fish hunter. That one says spider. So that one's yellow, brown, and gray. Oh, I really don't know. Well, one do you think? Do you think I should go halfway? Get these ones, the ones that say fish hunter. New Gary Scott sunglasses, specified design for anglers in an additional... Okay, so that, I think they will do the same thing, to be honest. Other than they're different color, one's gray, one's brown, one's yellow. I think they are all the same. By the middle. I'm getting a Unity error. Got back from work, update and want to play, but can't. Uh, shut your shut your Steam account down, then restart it. If it still has a problem, then maybe report it. Okay, well, we'll have to buy the middle ones then. I think the ones that are too nighty. I don't. I didn't really plan on spending any money on the game today. I would like to get the standard ones and the best ones. If I, if I did that, and then I could show you the difference between the cheaper ones and the better ones, but. That'd be free 90 bait coins. I'll have to buy more bait coins. Mm. It's a hard choice. I'm just going to get. Let, let's just. Uh. <laughs> we get the middle ones. Uh, then I might make a separate video of buying the other glasses when I got a bit more cash. Uh, we'll buy all three glasses. I'm not going to do it right now because, yeah, my cash flow is not the best. But we'll go with the middle one for now. And then I might make a separate video on each pair of glasses. Well, I do one video and I show the standard glasses, that glasses, and that glasses. All as in as one. I heard a beep there. What was that beep? That was strange. All right, anyway, let's, so that's that. Let's have a look at Tackle, because they've added some new stuff there. <coughs> Hopefully, that do, if that costs bait coins for the new Tackle as well, then I'm going to have no choice to to buy bait coins, aren't I? Okay, so there, that's bait coins. But it's not very much, though. Slider. Slider floats, especially designed for sliding rigs. Sliders are available to fly further than common floats, which is what I mentioned, didn't I? I did say that in, a, in the stream yesterday, the update that I mentioned yesterday, I said about that they're going to add some kind of new float thing so you can... So that way you can get a lot, lot more distance in casting. So that's, again, a thing that they've added early, so that's really good. Isn't the pack cheaper? It probably was, man. But no, nobody saw that. Nobody saw it. It's absolutely pouring down with rain today, is it? It's, it's, uh, here it's just really, really cloudy, man. Just really cloudy. So that's one new float. Let's have a look see what else they added. So there's the other float there. There's another one. There's the other one. So did they add a new rig to put it on, or how's it work? We'll, we'll figure it out in a moment. Uh, 
Wage your light, wager light, medium, heavy. I love when they get these new updates, it gives me such a buzz. I might not seem as buzzy as what I normally am, and it's just I haven't had any sleep. Too much editing all the time. Oh, uh, okay, so if we get we could get that one, that one costs cash. So we'll buy that one. And then if we get one of these ones as well. The slider heavy. Maybe that one probably would have been better. I don't know. I oh, know that's probably because it's at a different different level. At level 26, that's pretty good. That one's level 25. So if you're not a very high level, at least it still gives you the ability. That one there is level 18, four bait coins. Oh, okay. So I think that's pretty much all they added, if I'm honest. But we'll have a quick little sc scroll through the other stuff. The sunglasses and the ability to, to cast a lot further. We're also going to fish today. The lake that I've been dreading. Which is Can Creek. I say dreading just because it's just... I don't know why. It's just something about that lake. I'm not a big fan of it. So, we've never fished there while being live. So, we're going to take a shot there. And we'll see what happens. It's not like I can't catch fish there. I can catch fish. It's just, I don't know why. I just don't like that lake too much. Okay, let's just have a quick look on the boats as well. It's always good just to check everything. You never know. Alright. Okay, so that's everything. Well, let's put a float on here. Oh, yeah, I've only got the one float rod. Oh, okay. So we're only going to be able to use one. But we could take more, the other one with us. And then we could we could switch between the two and see how far we can cast. Okay, so let's there we go. So I've, okay, so I can just apply it normally. I don't even have to have a lead on. I can just apply it straight onto onto my float rod. So that's really good. It's a shame this update wasn't on PS4 today because I got two float rods on PS4. I don't on PC and I don't have another float rod there. Ah, uh, that sucks. Oh well. Okay, yeah, so we got to then go to here. Okay, the sunglasses have already put it on itself. And it says it does have a durability. So, alright. My net is probably does need fixing up, but it's alright for now. Alright, let's change a few hooks. Let's get into the new lake. Uh, well, not new lake, but let's get into a lake. We get into a lake and we'll see, we'll see what we can how far we can cast with it. Normally it is around about 120 uh, 120 to about 130 foot normally. I'm in the wrong storage, that's why I'm not finding what I need to find. Yeah, let's see if we, how much further we can cast. Okay, so I think four hooks I think four would probably be the best. I don't know, we're gonna do one of six. And see which one we get more interest now you got to bear with me a little bit in can creek because it's been a long time since i've fished that place and i mentioned before i'm probably not the i'm not a, i'm not a big fan of that place i don't know why i just don't really i just don't really like it too much but we'll give it a shot we'll see what happens i'm interested to see with those glasses how they work all right I always said that I would never fish here while being live. <laughs> Just because of how slow it is. Oh, wow, okay, so what's going on there? What? Why has it brought me to here? It, sh it brings up all of the licenses. That's... Why does it do that? That's definitely different then. Strange. Anyway, okay. So Alaska um, advanced license 8,000. Alright, let's do it. Uh, 
How deep does it go? Yeah, apparently it's meant to be different depths now as well. The slider, we're, we're, we'll find out. We'll definitely find out. Why does that chat keep on coming up there? I don't know why it keeps coming up. It's hard. I can't, I can't remove it. People are saying that FPS isn't very good. Okay, let's go into the settings quick. Have a look at my video settings, what we got that set at as well. Okay. Why is that? Let me, can I, 50 hertz, 74, okay. We'll leave it like that, okay, that's good. Let's see what happens. Let's see how far I can cast this float rod. I'm definitely interested in seeing the glasses as well. I did see a little bit of a preview with the glasses. Not somebody wearing them, but I did see pictures of the sunglasses and I did show I did mention about the sunglasses, but I didn't show anything on the last stream just because I wanted to make it a first time reaction anytime we see this stuff. But the loading's definitely different. As I said, I'm not a massive fan of this place, so that's why <laughs> first time first time fishing here. Wow. It's uh it's a cloudy day, so I, w I do want a sunny day. I don't know where I'm going to fish. Maybe in the middle? Hmm. Let's have a look down the other side. There's quite a few people there. I could always go into a, a friend's only room. Uh, we got a little campfire there. <coughs> yeah, there's a lot of people down there. Wow. I can walk up here. Maybe cast over this way. Uh, let's change over to the float rod. Let's have a look at the line depth of it. Three inches up to... Oh, wow. 196. Okay, that's definitely more. I think before it went to... I think it was about five to... What was it? Five to... I think about 120 something. So that's definitely more. That's definitely more. What am I even doing right now? Okay, let's go to the, the middle. Can I stand? I might, uh, do you know what? I'm going to go into a friend's only room just in case anything. It seems like some people are not too happy with the update. So talking about the FPS and that kind of thing. I don't want any bad language. I try and keep everything family friendly. Obviously, I do myself, but if other people... I can't always control what other people say. Well, it's taken so long to load. I only went from a random room to a private room. That chat is annoying. Why can I not remove that chat? There you go, I can. That's better. <clears throat> Otherwise, I'm just going to see it keep popping up. Okay. I might slough fish here. I could give here a shot. How far can I cast now? Oh my jeez, that is... Oh my gosh, wow. That is insane. So from 120 foot, let's see how far we can cast now. My music stopped. That wasn't a completely full cast, but. Oh my god! 306 foot! Wow! Wow! So that as a top, top cast could probably get the distance of. I'd say about 315 foot. That is insanely far cast. That's really good. I like that. Okay, so that was with that float. The Waggler X Heavy. Let's try the other float. Just so that way we can see if there's much difference between the two. So slider heavy. Let's put that on. Mm, I don't think it can cast as far as the other one, but we'll see. 
definitely not as far as the other one. Yeah, it's not as far as the other one, but it's still a lot further than what you can normally cast. So, 174 foot. So maybe the other one might be best to use. Because if you wanted to get some distance, yeah, the other one's good. That's insane. 300 odd foot compared to 120. I think the furthest was probably about 126. So Waggler is probably the better float to use. You can proper get some insane distance with that. That's... Yeah, that's... Oh. I just dropped something off my desk. Don't worry about that. Okay, so how do we now use the sunglasses? That's what I'm interested to find out. Do I press up? No. Down? No, that's for that. Maybe I have to scroll to the sunglasses. No. Hmm. Okay, I press Y. That's for the map. I press B. That takes me to there. I press X. Let's change day. A. Click down the analog stick. No, that changes our casting method. I gotta find out which button it is. <laughs> okay, click down on the right analog stick. No, D pad. Hmm. RB. That's for our bait. I don't know. I don't know how I. How do I get the sunglasses then? I do have them equipped, don't I? Yeah, I do have them. This is A to unequip. How do I. I'm gonna need to go into the settings to find out. It would tell me. It should tell me there. Key binding. Blood stand, hand casting, move left, right. Open chat, scroll chat, HUD on off. Next special item, L maybe. Take the special item, F. Flashlight on and off. Oh, there you go. G. Polaroid glasses. Okay, let's do that. I'm not sure what that will be on a controller on for Xbox or PS4, but... Oh my gosh, wow. <laughs> yeah, that is very, very different. Oh my... That is... Let's get a sunny day. Let's get a sunny day. That is insanely different. I like that. Oh, come on. Don't keep giving me cloudy days. Don't make me burn my cash. It's 2,000 a day. Okay, let's hit G again. Oh, my jeez, man. Yes. Fishing Planet. What an update, man. That looks so good. And it's not even properly sunny yet. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Alright, so we leave the glasses on, definitely. That is that in itself looks like a game changer. I didn't put out the um I didn't put out my rod stand. Nobody saw that. I can't believe that. That is Oh gosh. We're experiencing some big big issues. I uh, don't expect me to catch too much here, because as I said, this is not a lake that I'm too into if I'm honest but we'll see what happens if, it, if, if I don't do too well we can always change late but I'm pretty sure we we will catch something all right so I'm gonna I can't believe that I could take the leader up to 196 inches now that's really good and how far I can cast this 315 foot with that new with that new light leader slider whatever whatever you want to call it there's again arrow good to see it what is the name again of it let me see I keep forgetting the name of it Waggler, there you go. Yeah, the Waggler. That is insane how far I can cast that rod now. That makes me, in a way, that makes me now want to... No, 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 this is not a beta test. This is actually a live update right now. I did say before about doing beta testing, but I want to kind of keep it to, to not, in a way, so that way... 
when the updates come and I say there's an update, the update is for everybody else at the same time. But the glasses are absolutely insane. Look at that, that's without glasses. And that is with glasses. I cannot believe that. Oh my jeez, that is amazing. When it gets to six and that sun comes up even more, we'll put the glasses on again. And then it will look even better. I'm going to keep them on for now because that just looks so good. I love that. Done a really, really good job. It feels like it's a lot smoother as well. It, feel, it really feels a lot smoother. Normally when I'm using the controller on PC, now I play on PS4 and PC, but normally when I play on PC and I try and move the analog stick on the controller, it goes a little bit cranky. Like it, I turn it a little bit left or right and it goes foof, foof, like it sways all over the place. So they've definitely, like even moving backwards and forwards, it's a lot more easy to position. Moving left and right. It's only a silly little update, but that makes such a difference. I love that straight away. And we've got to fish on, so not bad. First time fishing here in years. Literally years fishing this place. I know we will catch some fish, but I just, I don't know. I'm just not a big fan of this place. It's definitely a lot better for positioning. Before it would just scroll on its own and it keep running, whereas if now it, it actually stops. So that is a big difference. That really is a big difference. I really do like that. Let me bring that float in a little bit more. So that way I can I can see it a bit a bit better. Oh wow, that was a really insane quick hit. I'm not even getting a chance to put the other rods out at the minute. <clears throat> <laughs> when I'm fishing somewhere else here, it sucks. All right, man, no worries. Yeah, I'm not a massive fan on this lake, if I'm honest, but I can't believe them them sunglasses. Look at that. As again, Jane, welcome to the stream. Look at that. From that to that. Wow. That is amazing. I really, I don't know what I like better, the sunglasses or the positioning of of this that is definitely a lot smoother that is so much smoother now we got some natural eggs on this one that is so much better for casting sometimes I, I would use the controller and then sometimes I have to go back and I have to start using the the mouse because I just can't position properly it would just move too. It would just move around too much, but they definitely love that. I'm gonna put a bigger hook on and see if we can get a bigger fish there as well. But they, that spawn sack, they seem to be quite interested in that. I can't believe how good this update is. Looks really good. The sunglasses look amazing. So the spawn sack, they seem to like that. So if I use spawn sack, but just a little bit bigger of a hook. We haven't had any interest at all on that float rod. So maybe, maybe we'll change this float rod depth and, okay. <laughs> yeah, let's change the float rod. The, we'll change the depth and change the hook and bait. See if we can get something a little bit bigger there. So as I mentioned, I was meant to be fishing on PS4 today, so we could play with subscribers, but I thought on the off chance, I thought I'll have a look just to see if there is any updates, any news on any updates, which is what I always keep an eye on and let you guys know as quick as I can. Mm, let's pull that about 87 inch inches. I don't know why that number, but just, just because. So we got the hash six on there. Yeah, so I thought I'll have a look, see if there's any updates, any news on any updates. And yeah, that popped up. It popped up on Steam. I, I thought I'd sign into Steam, have a look there as well. And then I sign into Steam. And then it come up saying that there was the summer update. So I'm glad I did that. How's it going, BG? Good to see you again, man. 
<laughs> you just finished your science test. You bet, you bet that you pass. Hopefully you did, man. I can't believe these sunglasses. They look so good. If they're that good as well, I'm kind of interested in in buying the the newer ones as well. Buying the newer glasses is obviously gonna. I'm gonna have to spend my own real money to do that. Chum chum salmon. I'm pretty sure they go up to unique in here. <clears throat> Let me put a bigger hook on. We put a bigger hook. It might take a little bit longer to catch, but we will avoid those smaller fish. Let's see. Brown trout eggs. Mm. Let's use those as well, just so I get them used up, get them out of the way. Yeah, the sunglasses look awesome, man. Even, <coughs> um, like, c controlling it as well. From, from using the controller before, it was very hard to position because it would scroll all over the place and now it's so much smoother. So that's a that's a big game changer just even that in itself. Don't forget to drop a like on the stream guys. It lets us know that you are enjoying fishing planet still. We normally stream this Monday to Friday, sometimes weekends if I'm not too busy. I could try the swim bait here. I don't know how well the swim bait would work. But we could we could try it. The sunglasses do look really good though. I want to wait till the sun comes up properly, and then when it does, we'll see how it looks. And I'm guessing, obviously, the other sunglasses are going to give you kind of a different effect. So I think I might end up buying, I might end up spending some of my real cash buying more bait coins. We've got some interest on that one. That float rods and really not doing much. Chin hook salmon. Now, as I said, the pace here might not be as quick as as some of the other places that we normally fish, but that is, I haven't fished here. I've been playing this game in total for. Four, year, four years and something, so close to five years, and I haven't fished in this place for for years. It goes to show when we come in here as well. It even come up saying that I got the first <laughs> first time coming in this lake, because I haven't even fished on this lake on, on PC. I have on, I have on PS4, but I haven't on PC. I think the four works better. Maybe the six is, is too much. Maybe the six is a bit too much. I might just jump to the sunny day, you know. Oh, I guess we ain't got too long. Well, not the sunny day, but just when the, the clouds shift off a little bit. Because I want to see how good it looks then. The controller feels so much smoother. It feels so much smoother. I love that. I really do love that. That is awesome. I didn't expect these sunglasses to, to come out so quick either. They said the sunglasses were going to be coming in the update of the new map. <coughs> yeah, the four hook seems to be the one. That's the only rod that we keep on getting, getting fish on. I might need to change the other ones. I want to get something on the float rod. Yeah. So we didn't have no interest on that at all. And I got spawn sack on there. So either I don't have the, the line of the depth right. Or the hook is a little bit too, too big. It could probably be a combination of both. Let's take that up to 90 inches. If we don't get any interest in that float rod now, then it is definitely, definitely the way that I've got the lead. I need to adjust it more in the water to get it right. 
<coughs> that one just non-stop keeps going. Let me change that swim bait as well. Um, what should we use? Maybe that might be good. I think a four is going to be best here, isn't it? Yeah, we'll try the we'll try the four. I can't believe that. I wouldn't. We we ain't, we ain't got long left. Sixteen minutes in game time. That's not real time. And then we should see how good these sunglasses look when when that sun. The clouds has moved away from the sun. I'm gonna. I probably, as I said, I probably am gonna end up buying the other sunglasses. I don't know whether to do that. I don't know whether to do it in this stream or whether to make a separate video of all three glasses, but as one video. I'm not sure. Oh, there we go. I told you that this would work better. This rod as well, it's not the most strongest rod. Bless you. A4 will be best. What do you mean? A4 will be best. Did I miss a comment? No, I didn't. Oh, the rod. Yeah, yeah, it's not a very strong rod, but some people don't like it when I use stronger rods for some reason. Well, not for some reason. They say that I bring the fish in too easy and I shouldn't be doing that. <clears throat> well, there we go. Our float rod's finally going. Oh, this could be a good one. Yeah, people like to see uh, people like to see you struggle sometimes. So by me using that lighter rod, it definitely does create it harder for me to just reel it straight in. People do like to see you struggle. That's not a bad size though. That one, 29 pound and a half. I see some movement there on the water. I see some more over there. It's definitely a lot smoother for moving the rods around. From even just moving left and right, it's so much smoother. I really do like that. I love the sunglasses, especially when it gets to six, it's going to look really good. Let's take the sunglasses off for a minute. So that way, when the sun comes out properly, we can then put it on and see how much of a difference it is. Yeah, people like to see the struggle. They don't like to see me reel it in too quick. That's why I use that lighter rod. I am also going to be getting some other lighter rods at some point as well, just because... People like to see that struggle. It's so much smoother though for for positioning. Sometimes, as I said, sometimes it would be okay on the controller. And then sometimes I would have to keep using the mouse because you just can't position it exactly right because it just moves all over the place. But that was... Um, yeah, that's definitely a, a lot different. I like that. That's a big, big change. Yeah, I'm going to get some lighter rods. Well, the rod that I'm using now, this spinning rod, is definitely a lighter rod. I'm going to buy a couple of other lighter rods. People always question me why I always use the heavy rods. And it is just because I can bring the fish in quicker. and It's not so time-consuming. But, yeah, people like to see the struggle. Me, myself, I'd rather use a heavier rod just so that way I can reel it in quicker and then get to picking up the next fish. That's just the way I like to do it. The quicker I, I bring in that rod, the quicker I can get another fish going. It can be, it really can be time consuming, it really can. If I'm using a heavy rod, I could re reel in a fish within within about 30 seconds. By me using a lighter a lighter rod that isn't as strong, it can take me real time up to five, ten minutes. 
So, and within then five, ten minutes of me fighting that one fish, but I have heavier rods, I could end up bringing that fish in and then bringing in other fish at the same time, so. Yeah, that's the thing. Yeah, that's why I use the heavier rods. <coughs> Come on, where's that sun? It's six o'clock. Why's the sun not come up properly? I'm gonna jump forward time, I think, just so we can see how good the sunglasses look. Well, it's not actually. It's coming now. Now well, let's have a look now. Oh my gosh, wow, it makes such a difference. Look at the sky. That That is such a difference. That's insane how different that looks. Yeah, I, that, that is a really good update. That is a really good update. I like that. <coughs> They took it quite a long time to bring these sunglasses out, and now I now I sort of understand why it took them so long, because that really does make a very very big difference. It really looks so different. Yeah, I'm gonna jump onto the boat. Oh, there is no boat here. Ah. Oh, okay. I ended up going to another spot as well. <laughs> we'll take the time forward. We'll take the time forward so we can get it a little bit brighter. Oh my gosh. It looks so much more colourful even just looking at the... Look at that. Looking at the floor from there to putting them on. So much of a difference. That's a really big difference. Okay, so that's with them on. Taking them off. Don't look too much like that. It's more... I think it's more for the fact when you look, you look up in the sky. When you look up in the sky, that's where you see, that's where you see a massive, massive difference. So that's off. Let's put them back on again. That is crazy how much of a difference that is. You know what? This is not, as I said, it's an okay like. But I haven't fished there for many years, so it's not going to be too entertaining. It's going to be a little bit slow. So let's go fish somewhere that looks really beautiful. And where the days are a lot more sunny. Then we can see those glasses a bit more in better action. Yeah, there's a very big difference, isn't it? Yeah, looking up to the sky makes a really big difference. Yeah, it's been years since I fished that place. <clears throat> As I've mentioned before, I'm not a big fan on that, that lake. I really ain't. But I just thought I'd fish there just so that way it was a little something different for other people to see. Well, let's go into Peru because that's where everybody always tells me to go every single time. Oh, look at the loading screen. Even that loading screen's different as well. Yes, I know, it's that, yeah. <laughs> I say it, and then you say it a few seconds later. The game is, it definitely feels smoother. I did notice. I just didn't bother to say anything. Hmm, come on, loading. I really want to buy the other sunglasses, but that means I'm going to have to spend money if I do. Hmm. Um, I need to remove that as well. How do I get rid of that again? There we go. I have to keep hitting that button to keep getting rid of the, the chat. Let's get a sunny day. I can't believe how good them sunglasses are. So much of a difference. Too funny. How's it going, Matthew? Good to see you, man. 
buy them, go for it, treat yourself. <laughs> I probably wouldn't have to spend that much. I'd probably, I don't know, around about 20 pounds. So I could buy the other two glasses, but... Oh wow, day four and we still ain't got a sunny day. Day five. There we go, sunny day. Alright, are you guys ready for it? The sun's not completely up yet, but... Oh wow, that is so good. I'm always going to be using sunglasses on this game now. For real. It is more, I think it is definitely more of a difference when you're... When you're looking up into the sky more than anything. That is so different. Uh, the sunglasses stand at bait coins. I think they are, man. I think they are. And I think they do that so obviously that way people then then end up spending a bit of cash on the game. Uh, they, they probably... They, they could change it at some point. You never know. Sometimes they do change it. But what a difference that is. That's, that's a really big difference. All right, is anybody in our spot? No one is in our spot, so perfect. Let's get up there. I could buy something real with that money. Yeah, so could I. <laughs> That's why I haven't brought any bait coins yet, because I don't know whether to. It really does look a big difference, though. Especially when that sun comes up. That's when it's going to look really different. Even the map as well, pulling out the map, the map feels like it's a little different as well. The con controlling it feels different. Trying to cast definitely feels different, which is good. There's a guy on Ace, I changed the controls on my TV. <laughs> That's one option. So we did start off in Can Creek. Wasn't the best of starts. And we did catch some fish, so that, at least that's that's something. But Now, let's hit the sunglasses again. Let's see. That is insane how good that looks. And people always said that Fish and Planet, the graphics are not good. That's made a... That's definitely made it different. That's definitely made it different. Uh, I'm not quite sure how it's going to look on PS4. I know the up update hasn't released on PS4 yet because I have been on PS4 before I set up the stream. I was looking on PS4 and it didn't didn't mention or show anything about the update. So that could be later on today or it could be another day. I'm not exactly sure when that's going to be. But I will let you guys know when it does. When it does, I will tell you. Now, I like the fact that I can definitely cast insanely far with that from casting 130 feet to 315 that is a massive difference so that's really good i like that you can you can get more distance on there all right we've got three with shiners take them off and then back on they're off at the minute and this is when they're on I'm on PS4 now and no update yet. There's, yeah, I've done the system software update myself, yeah. When the update does drop for PS4, I will let you guys know. But at the minute, there is no there is no information for the update for PS4. But I'll definitely let you know when there is. Anytime there is updates on this game as well. If you're subscribed, you ain't ever going to miss out on an update on this game. I can't believe how much of a difference that is. That's such a game changer. It looks so much better, and again, even positioning your cast is so much more smoother, so much more accurate. I love that. Yeah, you do notice a big difference. Yeah, I definitely do too. But not just for casting, like casting seems to, before it would kind of, like I move it to a spot and then it would kind of like run to the side a little bit like that, whereas if now it don't, same goes as moving backwards and forwards is a lot more a lot more smoother I can position it so much better now I really like that how much of a difference that is is insane even just not just with casting but even moving from rod to rod it would kind of scroll a little bit more whereas if now 
now it kind of sticks. So I like that. I do love the sunglasses, but honestly, I don't know what I like better, the sunglasses or how they changed the casting. Well, not changed the casting, but made it made it so much more precise. You can cast it in so much better now. That was a thing that really did bug me sometimes. Sometimes using the controller, sometimes the mouse, whereas if now, I can always use the controller all the time. The sunglasses are 100 bait coins. And then... What was it? 100? I think 290 for the maximum one. And then I brought some... I've forgotten the one, how much the ones that I brought were. Okay, there you go. So 100. And then 230. And then 290. So it's probably is what I will do. I probably will end up doing a separate video. I'll, um... Not that I want to spend any real money, but... Just for the content, it looks like I'm going to have to. But I make a video, and in that one video, I will sh show about the, I will show about how far the rod can now cast and the positioning. But these are the glasses that we're using at the minute, the fish hunter. But I make a separate video of it, of these three glasses in one video, and we we will then see the difference between each one. I'm gonna go have fun playing. All right, okay. Thanks for dropping by. So I was right, bait coins. Yeah, it's bait coins. And I've only got 125 bait coins, so I could buy that. I could buy them standard ones, but then that would leave me uh, 25 bait coins. Then they cost 290. So how much is 290 bait coins? £10.49. But I couldn't buy that because if I buy that, I still need bait coins because we keep live streaming and we catch fish at a fast pace. It's going to cost me £21. £21 to show to show you guys an update. <laughs> well, it might have to be done. It might have to be done. It looks like wearing these glasses, though, it definitely does look like there's a lot more colour to the game. It really makes a, a big difference. Uh, it wouldn't have come out on Xbox, man. Okay, look at that. It's still pulling my line out, and I've got it maxed. It never, ever used to do that before. Oh, that sucks, man. I don't like that. I've got it maxed, and it still pulls out the line. I don't like that. That's exactly why I always match my rods up with the, with the reels. So that way it doesn't run. And now it does. I don't like that. I don't like that. Definitely don't. It means it's going to take even longer now to reel fishing. Not a fan of that. Oh, that sucks big time. I can't believe that. I only just noticed that. They did say that though in the update. Oh, that's an absolute pain, that. I don't like the idea that it can run like that. Let me quickly... Um, I'm going to quickly ring my dad. See if he's around. Maybe he might want to come with us. Let me see. Hold on. I'm just going to put the mic the mic on mute just for one second just in case just in case he does answer All right. He does know about the update. He's taking a he's taking an afternoon nap. 
he didn't. He said he didn't get much sleep last night. So, yeah, new bottom rods, new match rods, but they they ain't gonna be. Um, well, they did say the new bottom rods and match rods are gonna be part of the the update for the new map. But as they brought the sunglasses early, it means there is a good possibility that they could end up bringing the new rods the new rods early as well. I don't like the idea that this can run now. I really don't. Like I've got the best reel and the best rod to, to stop it from running and now it can run. I'm not a big fan of that. I literally cannot stop it from running which it equals so much so much more time consuming. These fish are kind of hard to bring in anyway but, but for the fact that now it runs like it is good fun but yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be very very time consuming to bring in each fish now like that. It means that I'm not gonna be able to do it quick anymore, which would probably make me not wanna to be honest, probably not to catch <laughs> too many of those big fish. Maybe to catch some of those smaller fish so that way I don't. Nobody saw that. Yeah, catch some of those smaller fish so that way I don't spend too much time with these big fish where they keep on running off all the time. Because this could be such a small fish. This could be only like 60, 70 pounds, but yet. Because now it runs. Look at that. I physically. I've got the best I can have for this rod. And yet it still runs. Oh, that's such a pain. Stop running. And the, the one thing is to take into into account now is for the fact it does run, if you never used to have much line on your reel, now you are going to need to put more line on your reel. So that's one thing you definitely are going to have to do now. <clears throat> if you don't have much line, you'll end up getting despooled. It's so annoying that I can't stop it. <clears throat> I think that's the only thing I'm not a big fan of on this update. It's just that the sunglass is awesome, and for the fact that we can now cast the the float rod a lot a lot further, that's really good. From 120 odd feet to now three over 300, that's really good. That you can get some serious distance. But look how long I've been fighting this fish now. That is absolutely bonkers, silly. That is bonkers, silly. It really is. Yeah, yeah. I don't really, I don't really need the XP now. I'm max level. I just, I just farm it out. So I've got enough cash. So when those new updates drop, I'm able to show. I'm always able to show that new content. So we do this stream, and then later on today, I will drop another video. It, it, normally I drop it about 6 but it could be a little bit later than 6 because I'll uh, I spend some more more money some real money I, I, yeah I spend some money I buy, I buy those glasses and then I'll make a separate video of well it'd be one video but all of those three glasses in the same video so we can see the difference between each one look at that 123 pound it only took me a month to reel that in that is crazy, man. Everything about this update is so much better. The the color and the casting and how far you can cast, how you can position the cast so much better. I just don't like the idea. I can't stop it running. I don't like that at all. Some people like that, though, because they obviously they like to... I like to fight the fish longer, which as I said, that's why I was going to buy some lighter rods because it is a bit more fun to do that, but even though it's fun to do it, it's, it's just all about time consuming. It just takes so much longer to bring that fish in now. I 
I'm not sure if I like that idea. But I guess now I don't really need to buy lighter rods, do I? <laughs> I was going to buy lighter rods so that I could play the fish more, but... Yeah, I don't really need to, to play the fish more now for the fact that even when I've got it maxed out, it's still going to run off. It's so much better for positioning Carson, though. That is one thing that I notice. Can I take the sunglasses off? Okay, you can take them off while you got the rod in your hand. That is a really, really big difference, though. Looks so much more colourful like that, especially the sky. The sky looks really different. And this is only the the second best pair, so if we buy the cheaper pair, as I said, I make a separate video. We'll buy a cheaper pair, and then we'll buy the, the better pair, and then we'll show all three of them <clears throat> and see which one's better, which one's which one's more worth to buy? And then I can waste my real money. And I can waste my bait coins so that way you guys don't have to. So don't bother to buy them just yet. Wait until I make that video. And then that way you don't end up buying all three like I do. Unless you want all three and then buy. By all means, it's go for it. But if you're not sure what pair to buy, wait until I make that video. Okay. This one's a smaller fish, so we'd have to fight it so long. Everything, even the reeling feels really different in some sort of way. I, I can't explain it. It's strange. The reeling feels... I don't know. It definitely feels like they've done something different with the reeling. I wonder if people are going to start complaining about the fact that you can't stop the fish running because I'm not the only person who does that if a lot of people do complain about it then they will end up taking it back to what it was they are pretty good at listening to the to the community so that's one good thing so if there's a lot of people that does report and say that they they don't like that the fish can run anymore they don't want that to be like that yeah if they do there's a good possibility they might take it back But then I think that a lot of people probably would. I think the only people that probably wouldn't like it too much is probably streamers because obviously they wanna, they don't want to spend too long reeling in that same fish. It's such a pain that I can't stop it running now. Like I could probably get a better reel, but then if I did, it would just put damage on the rod. There's just no way I can stop it from running. It's a shame like you don't have a, a break or something on the reel to stop it doing that. So you have a choice whether you want it to run or not. So look, I, the amount of time I'm spending with this fish right now, because it keeps on running off, I could be getting that one. I, was, I know it's going to happen. 60 pound, you see what I mean? It takes takes too long it definitely takes too long I think it's gonna be the same like that with the float rod isn't it let's see okay it's not a big fish so we can't find out yet I like the way that's set up though look at that that looks good that's definitely an awesome thing they added to to give you the ability to cast further with a float rod is definitely a good thing. Because a lot of people will only use float rods. They don't like to use bottom rods. They only like to use the floats. And for the fact that you can cast a lot further, that might actually make people want to use a float rod more as well. To be honest, that's probably why I didn't really use a float too much. For two reasons. One, you can't get the distance. And two... If you're in a place where where it kind of, like, the, the, the water's dragging to one side, left or right, it, bring, it takes you float all over the place, so. Yeah. How's it going, Gadget? I don't think I've ever seen you before, man, so if you're new, welcome to the stream. Alright, let's put our sunglasses back on, see what it looks like now. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. 
That is so much better. I just don't like that I can't stop it from running. I know I'm, I know I keep complaining about it, but I used to have this rod set out absolutely perfect, and now it doesn't matter what I do. I'm not going to be able to stop the fish from running anymore. Which, because I can't stop it from running as well, means that it's going to take me longer to fill up my net. Unless I'm going for smaller fish, but then if I'm going for smaller fish, again, that's going to take longer to fill up the net also. So, it's kind of, yeah, I don't know. So I guess it's not a bad idea if you're going for the bigger fish, but... Oh, is it? Okay, man. Yeah, look, I can't stop it. I can't stop it from running. The one thing that does look pretty cool, though, when it does run is I can actually see the spool on the reel spin round, which it's not very often I see that because I don't normally let the fish run like that, so. It's not often I see that at all. Such a shame I can't stop it from running though. Look at that 65 pound. It took so long to bring that in. Maybe I'm not always going to go for big fish all the time. Well, I don't all the time. Every now, every now and again we fish different lakes and we catch different fish. But it probably would make me want to get maybe some of those smaller fish rather than always the bigger fish now I'm not gonna fill my look at that I'm not I haven't filled my net up nowhere near as quick as what I normally do we got 263 in the net it's at 6 618 we start at 5 normally by the, around about this time um, normally we got like 500 pounds in the net sometimes more than that so and it, again, it is just because of how long it's taken me to fight that one fish. Not, not good. It's gonna. It means that it's gonna be that little bit longer for the, for that cash grind or XP grind. It probably wouldn't be if you're not going for bigger fish. So yeah, that's one thing to take into account. If you've got a good rod, and you're going for the smaller fish, and then yeah. Uh, the new update is the the glasses. That that's without the glasses, and then I put the glasses on. It makes it look very very different. There's three three different glasses, and there's also different. Um, there's a waggler and something called this slider, which that you can put on your float rod. Your float rod normally only gets around about 120 cast, about 120 foot cast, and that's maximum. But now you can cast just over 300 foot, like 315 feet, which is a very, very big difference in distance of how far you can get. Which, as, as I said, I'm pretty sure that would make people, uh, probably make people want to use the float rod a little bit more. But the fact that you can cast that a that little bit further, well, a lot further. You can cast almost 200 feet more than what you used to be able to. And not just that, but also catching fish, even if you've got a good reel with your rod to max it out, you can't stop it from running anymore. And casting as well. Casting and moving around, it always kind of, if you use a controller, it would always make you kind of sway to the left or right too quick. Whereas if now, it's a lot more precise. So that is, that's a, I, I love that. That's definitely a good thing. I'm not a fan of the fish keep running, but. we got to accept the update for what it is. It's still a good update in my opinion. For the fact that we can position cast a lot better. We can cast further with the the rods 
And these sunglasses do look pretty cool. So I'm not going to stream as long as what I normally do today. Just because I want to make that video on the sunglasses. I probably could do it in this stream, but I want to do it as a separate video because otherwise, if I do it in the stream, it means that people are going to come back and watch the whole entire stream to see that update. Whereas if if I make a separate video of around 10 minutes-ish or something like that, it means they ain't then going to have to watch the whole stream to find out the difference between each pair of glasses. So I'll end the stream a little bit earlier today compared to normal. And then we use each pair of glasses. Look at that run. Yeah, we use each pair of glasses and see see the difference between each one. I don't think you're able to carry the same glasses. Or at least I don't think you can carry multiple glasses with you fishing. I think it's only just... I think you can only carry the one. I don't know. If you can carry only the one, then I'm going to have to make some cuts and edits into a video. But if not, if you can carry all three pairs with you and you can change the pairs of glasses as you're fishing, the video will be a, a lot quicker, but it probably won't be that way. <laughs> no, you wouldn't stay long. <laughs> I did catch a few fish, man, but it wasn't, yeah, it wasn't that great. The last time I fished that place was literally years ago. No, no lie, it was years ago. It was. It's an okay place, but as I've mentioned before, that's out of every lake on Fishing Planet. That is probably the only lake I'm not a massive fan on, and I'm not a big fan on this now. But the fact that I cannot stop that fish running, it's going to take me so much longer to reel fish in now. That's such a pain. I cannot stop, I physically cannot stop it now. It'd be good if you could at least have a break on it. So you can choose whether you wanted it to run or not. It's going to be alright for these smaller fish. We can reel those in pretty quick. It's just them bigger fish. They're going to be very time consuming. I've normally got so much more weight in my net by now. I really have. There's a big difference. Even the, even the 60 odd pound fish are taking quite a long time for me to reel it in. <coughs> Not only it's more time consuming, but because it, the rod is and fighting the fish a lot longer means that the durability on the rod is probably going to go down quicker as well. Maybe catching those big fish all the time is not going to be the best way for the XP and cash grind anymore. I think that's a big fish on there as well. I think, yeah it is. See what I mean? I cannot, I just can't stop it from running. Mmm, fishing planet, why'd you do me like that, man? That was my, uh, that was the, a good thing for me to, to get cash and XP so fast. I hate it when people do that. There's always someone silly that gets in your way. Always. We're going to our own room in a minute. There's always got to be someone that's in the way. Yeah, they take the drag. Yeah, you can't. You, there's no way you can stop them, man. I got the I got the best reel and best rod. Got it maxed out, and you cannot stop him from running. That's what I. Th I don't think many people are going to be a big fan of that. Honestly, I'm definitely not. Sixty-five pound. How long it takes to reel in? Don't like. Don't like it. All right. Unfortunately, we had someone silly there. We had an absolute wet boot in our way. Oh, okay, we got to pick up the rods. Oh, come on, man. What are you doing? 
I don't know why people do stuff like that, man. So silly. Just people so ignorant. That's the people that we live with. But not in my game, I don't. <laughs> Let's get out of there. Um, okay, I, d I don't think there is anyone else fishing online with us, so I'm just going to go to a private room. Yeah, I can't believe they're taking the drag, man. I don't know if they're going to keep it like that. I don't know if that's going to make a lot of people frustrated and annoyed. As I say, sometimes they do listen to the community, so if a lot of people do complain about it, it's possibly they could change it. I'm going to buy the other pair of sunglasses. I don't think it's going to let me use it, though, until I back out of the lake. Is it going to... There we go. Okay. No. Alright, it doesn't. It goes into my home storage. So there's no point in me getting it yet. As I said, is what I do is I make a separate video. I spend some of my real money. I spend some of my real money and then we'll um, I make a separate video of showing all three glasses. So that way you guys don't have to buy all three. Unless of course you wanted to and then you could. But if you didn't want to, at least that way you could see which pair of glasses in your opinion does look better. Yeah, people are just so silly like that, man. It's You always get someone silly like that that has to spoil it for other people. The glasses are good though. The glasses is definitely an, an awesome update. And again, I think it probably looks a little bit better looking up to the sky because looking down on the water. No, I suppose it does make quite a difference on the water as well. Yeah, it definitely does make a difference to the water as well, actually. But it looks so colourful looking up to the sky. Look at that. Nice clue. Uh, clue? <laughs> nice blue clear skies. No, it does look really good. I can't believe that. That looks so much better. I'm so glad they bought that. Yeah. Definitely more colourful. Oh yeah, they'll definitely do that, man. When the new bottom rods come out, new match rods come. They'll make these heavy chasers weaker. That's probably why they do run. Yeah, that's a very good point. So when the new rods come, they don't already have to mess around nerfing the, the heavy chasers and stuff because the new rods are going to be the new ones that do stop it from, from the drag running. So that's a good possibility. Yeah, it really is. What's the update? The update is the sunglasses. Also, the... The Wager. Is it The Wager I think it's called? I forgot the name of it now. I keep forgetting the name of it. The Waggler, sorry. The Waggler Float or Slider as well. They allow you to cast a, an insane amount. Like you, With the Float Rod before you could only cast around, around 120, 130 feet maximum. Whereas if now you can cast like around 315 foot. So you can cast a lot, lot further using float rods now, which is really good. Um, the uh, the sunglasses is definitely, yeah, they are worth it for sure. They really are. But the thing that is a little bit of a pain is that now I've, I'm still using the same setup as what I normally do. Good strong rods, good reels. But when the fish pulls that drag, you can no longer stop it. It runs. You cannot, You cannot stop it. So that's a bit of a pain. The other thing that definitely makes a big difference as well is positioning casting. You can, before when you, I used to use the controller on PC, if I, if I move left or right, it would kind of scroll like that a little bit, which was, it was annoying. Whereas if now, you can position so much better. So I really do like that. Yeah. Yeah, I've seen a few. There is a few people showing the the new map already, but I don't want to. I don't like to try and spoil too much, man. Like if I'm showing stuff, 
too much. And then when I actually do buy the DLC and we get into that new lake, there's not going to be any excitement there because I've already, you know, I've already seen it, I've already done it, kind of thing. So, it I do think it's a lot more. It's nice to talk about the update and say what's in it and show things in the update, but when it comes to new maps, it's probably better just to see pictures of it rather than an actual whole entire video because of them when when it actually does come that excitement kind of dies yeah you probably could man yeah 315 foot cast that's a really big cast i don't know if they can cast further with the heavy chasers let me see oh no actually probably not because we don't have the float on there do we <laughs> Oh well. I don't like the idea of glasses for bait coins should be cash. Well, they probably do it for bait coins because so that way, you know, people will end up spending real money on the game just like I always I'm always buying out of my own pocket real money. I'm always buying bait coins, aren't I, to jump the days forward, keep showing new updates. I've always got to spend my own money to keep showing that new content. So I think that's why they've done it. But eventually, there is a good possibility that they might end up doing it at some point where where you can buy it with cash. Possibly. I don't know. I really don't know. I really didn't expect this update to drop today, but in, in all honesty, there was no talk to say. Obviously, the sunglasses have been saying that they've been coming soon. Um, yeah, it's just been saying it's been coming soon, and it's been saying it's coming soon forever, but other than that, I don't, yeah, I don't really know. Yeah, for the best, yeah, it's 11 99 for the best glasses. Okay, so you can, yeah. See, for me, I'm going to need to, I'm going to need to spend about £21, because I'm going to need to buy it the better sunglasses and then I'm going to need to buy the lower end glasses and then I'm still going to need bait coins left so when we do do live streams I can keep jumping those rubbish days forward so yeah I'm going to need to I'm going to need to spend about £20 or just over but I think if I make a video on it as well showing the three pairs of different glasses in stages and see which one, which one people like better. And then that way, by me doing that, it means you guys don't have to spend your real money doing it. <laughs> That's a big hook, man. Use size 10 to get rid of the piranha. That is a big hook. But yeah, I guess it does get rid of the smaller fish. That's why sometimes every now and again I do put on the, the bigger hooks to try and avoid some of the smaller ones. But now for the fact that you can't stop it, you can't stop the fish running, maybe you might want to start using smaller hooks. You're going to spend too much time. You're going to spend so much time trying to bring in that one fish because it just keeps running so much. Look at that. I cannot stop it from running. That really sucks, man. I hope it's only because they're going to bring out the new rods. I'm hoping that's what it is. But it did say about the, the drag, the fish can run off now. So I don't think it is because there's going to be new rods at some point. I don't think it's because of that. I think that's just a thing they, they've added into it that and that's the way it's going to be now. I'd like to see the difference between them. Yeah, I definitely want to see the difference between them. As I said, I spend some of my real money later on. After I've done the stream, I'll, I'll buy some bait coins. And then... And then I show all three sunglasses and see which ones look better. Well, then it might help people make up their mind on what they want to buy rather than spending spending money buying all three like I'm gonna be. Need an anchor to avoid the prana. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of people that they sometimes they do they do listen to the community. Sometimes they do, and it's good when they do. 
It is good. If people don't like things, that a lot of people complain about it. Normally they, they do change it. But I don't think they're going to be... Even with the even when the new match rods come and even the new the new bottom rods, I don't think they're going to stop it. I don't think they're going to stop the fish from running. I think that's just going to be a new thing now that we've all got to kind of live with, unfortunately. Like I mentioned quite a few times about me buying lighter rods so I can play the fish more. I'm not even going to need to buy any lighter rods anymore. Not now for the fact that this can run. That's why I was going to buy lighter rods, so that way it could run a little bit more and I'd have that little bit more play with the fish. But now I don't need to. Maybe a lighter rod for catching smaller fish, possibly, but... I haven't yet seen if it runs on the on the float rod. We haven't had a big enough fish on there yet, but I, I'm pretty sure it's going to. Or does it? Or maybe it might not on the float rod. Hold on. Oh no, okay, it does. <laughs> it doesn't seem like it does as much though. Yeah, no, it still does. It still runs. That's such a pain, man. So you don't really notice too much of a difference with the sunglasses until you until you don't have them on. Until you see it like that. When you see it like that, and then after you put, then after you hit them on, that's when you really do notice a big difference. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Makes farming longer, doesn't it? But look at that, 180 feet this has pulled me out. I've never, ever had an Arapaima pull me out that far. Look at that, 200 foot still going. The only problem is, though, bite being out that far makes you more chance to lose the fish. For me to pull in a 200 pound fish now, it is probably going to take me about a month, for real. <laughs> That's not good fun, man. But yeah, cut down the farming. Makes people be on the game longer. That is a pain. <laughs> you lost the battle. <laughs> I wonder if, it's, if it does that on the spin rods as well. Does it do, have you tried it with the spin rod? Does the spin rod run? I'm pretty sure it will, wouldn't it? It did say that they're they're adding the um, they're adding that, so I'm pretty sure that's for every rod. That's gonna take so much longer to reel fish in now, though. It's definitely gonna people are gonna have to put a lot more time into the game. That's for sure. They want to earn some money to catch those bigger fish. There's going to be so much more time consuming. That might actually make people try and catch smaller fish more often though. Look at that. It's so silly. I could literally cannot even stop it. I'm, I'm going to end up losing this fish for real. I've never ever in my life got to 300 foot with a fish on. Never ever. Out of my whole time of playing Fishing Planet. No matter what size fish, even when I had the lower end rods, I have never got a fish to pull me out at 300 foot. Definitely going to need a lot of line on your reels. And you don't even know if it's a really good fish anymore because, because of how much it's pulling the line out. Even when I had a fish on about, about 50, 60 pound. It still took a long time to reel in. I'm getting it back a little bit. Slowly. That is really time 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 consuming, it really is. I I'm not a big fan of that fishing planet. I'm definitely not. I always 
I always have to give my honest opinion. I'm not a fan of that. Again, I understand why they did do it though. It makes people grind that at that lot lot longer for sure. Carpen took me up 280 foot, and I had 310 on the spool. Yeah, you're definitely going to need a lot more line. They did say though. Um, in the new update for the new lake when they bring the new rods and reels that The reels were going to be thicker reels so you can apply a lot more line Obviously them saying about applying more line is Obviously because now it's gonna it's not gonna you can't stop the fish from running so that's obviously why they're gonna Apply new reels that can hold up more line that is a pain though that the the farming grind is going to be is going to be hard work. There's a tarpon. Take full spool, saltwater match rod setup. Yeah, you're definitely going to need a ton more line. But imagine fighting with with carpet willow will be fight. Yeah, it could be. That's uh, that's why I mentioned like I was going to buy lighter rods too to fight the fish that little bit longer but I don't think I need to now not now they've added this update I do like it in some way but in some way I don't now I could have definitely picked that rod up but because of this update look how long I've been fighting this fish I've been fighting this fish for a short minute The sunglasses though, look how much. Really does. That is an awesome update. I'm definitely happy about that. It really makes it so much more colourful. Hola, how's it going, Boris? If you can, English would be good, man. I, I understand it understand English, man. Will be a monster? Yeah. It'll probably be sixty pound. <laughs> a sixty pound monster. It's hard to tell now. Like, it was kind of hard to tell sometimes. You can't always judge it right, but even more so now. Even more so. That took a that took an insane amount of time to reel that in. That is a big fish, though. Not as big as what I thought. 169 pounds, but look how long it took to reel that in. That is absolutely bonkers how long it takes. That casting. Let me see if I can try to get a full cast. Let's see if I can try to get a full cast. See how... Ah, uh, that was just under. That is so much further, though. Look how long it's staying in the air. 297 foot. 297 feet. That is insane. Yeah, they do sometimes, yeah. That's why I said it. Sometimes it's hard to tell when, when you do have a big fish there. Sometimes because the the smaller fish, they have more of a fight because because they're more agile. Whereas if the bigger fish, they can't they can't move around as quick. At least I, I, that's kind of the way I look at it. It could be wrong, but yeah, they do. Some of the smaller fish they fight harder than the than the bigger fish. Look at that, it's 8 o'clock and I got 645 pounds in the net. It has never ever taken me that low amount of weight in my net within that time. The grind is going to be so much more now. The grind is going to be so, so much more. That is such a pain. So keep an eye out for the video. I'm going to drop a video after this stream. We're going to buy all three. Well, I've already bought one pair of sunglasses. We're going to buy another, the other two pairs. I'm going to spend some of my real money. We're going to buy some, some of the other glasses. And then we'll compare them to each other. And we'll see which one, which one is the best sunglasses. If I'm honest, probably... Let's go on to it. Probably them ones.
they probably are going to be the better ones just because they cost that a little bit more they're 290 whereas if the ones that we got are 230 but i buy that one and we'll buy that one and we'll see yeah we'll just put them side by side and see which ones are good i'm pretty sure they are all they all they are all going to be good but the ones that cost more i'm pretty sure they're going to be the ones that are slightly that slight little bit better i'm gonna have a busy day if you can man try keep it english because if it's not english i have to remove it just because we're family friendly and i can't yeah i could i could do translation but if i do translation for you everybody else who comes in i, I have to always translate it so if you can if you can't understand me then obviously you're not going to be able to but if you do know english hopefully you can try and only use english That is my only that is my only downfall. That is my only downfall for the fact that you can't stop it running. I just cannot stop it from running anymore. Other than that, I love this update though. For the fact that we can position cars so much better. The reeling definitely feels different. Fighting the fish is gonna take a couple of months now. <laughs> That was probably the quickest fish that I've reeled in so far. That was only 50 pound though, so that's probably why. Oh, we got the game glitch. There we go. Oh, wow. Yeah, maybe fishing for these bigger fish are definitely going to take a lot more wear on your gear as well look at that i physically i've got it maxed out and it, it cannot stop it running it's definitely going to take more wear on your gear because you're going to be fighting it that little bit longer now unless they give gave it a little bit of a buff so because it's going to be running longer maybe it could last your durability might not die down as quick possibly maybe i don't know they might have done that I don't really pay too much attention to the durability, if I'm honest, but you never know. I tried to real quick to get that. It didn't quite work out, did it? Look at these sunglasses, man. I'm definitely going to make a separate video on all three of them. If you're interested in seeing all three glasses, we're going to make a video after I finish this stream. So make sure you've got the notification bell hit. Otherwise, you will miss. You would definitely miss out on that video. It saves you buying all, all three glasses as well. Unless you, unless you just want to get all three and you don't mind spending money, then by all means go for it. Small hooks. Normally by this time, eight eight eighteen a.m. We've got 7.49 in the net. Normally by now, it is normally, my net's normally full. So the grind is going to be slower. More often I have to repair the rods and reels. Yeah, looks like that is going to be the way. It, I wouldn't mind repairing it that little bit more often if, if they made it a little bit cheaper to repair it. <laughs> Two hundred hour, yeah, two hundred pound will take take insanely long. It will. Real time, you're probably going to be fishing. If you catch anything around two hundred pound or plus, real time. I'm guessing it's going to be about 20, 30 minute fight. For real, it probably will be that. I'd say at least fifteen minutes. At least fifteen minutes at minimum. It is definitely going to take a short minute, isn't it? Let me try it. It's, it's going to do it for these as well, isn't it? I'm sure it is. I'm sure it is. But let's try it. Let's see if we can get a... Let's see if we can try grab an arrow primer on this rod. 
I'm sure it is going to do it with these spin rods as well, though. <laughs> At a 60 pound hour pimer, pulled you around for 60 minutes. Wow. <laughs> Yeah, it's only available for them at the minute for PC. I do play on PC and I do play on console as well, but I was meant to play on console today, but because this update, I saw this update dropped. Uh, probably about, the update probably dropped around about two hours just before I started the stream. Normally when there's updates on this game, I, I start streaming instantly. But yeah, I was busy editing some videos, so I didn't actually see the update. And then just before I set up the stream, I see the update was available on PC, but at the minute nothing for console, so there's a bit of a pain for the people that that don't have console, uh, only have console and don't have PC. But the one good thing about it is when I show these new updates and I'm spending my real money buying these things, at least that way you guys kind of, you could save money in a way, because by me buying it means that you don't have to buy it. If it turns out to be not very good. Okay, that's a light fish on there. Let's get that one. 20 pounds set up. <laughs> yeah. I think the tarpon would be good fun to catch. I'm, I'm pretty sure they will be. Now is probably the better time to actually being a boat. Not, not having the anchor down. Because... It pulling you around you've probably got more chance to really in that little bit quicker compared to fishing how I am like n like now it's just gonna keep on dragging that line out cannot stop it it'll take so much longer <clears throat> I'm kind of happy though overall, just for the fact of the glasses and the the casting further and it being a lot more smoother as well. And as, I don't know, I, and also as again, even reeling as I said, I can't really explain it, but it seems like they've changed something there. It's nice that I can see that. Oh, I can't look down at the reel. <laughs> It's nice that the reel, I can see the reel spinning though, like that, when it takes off. Because that's not something I see very often. Well, that's something I never see, to be honest. Because they always max everything out. Don't forget to drop a like on the stream as well, guys. Let's us know that you're still enjoying Fishing Planet. When them updates do come out, I do try my best to always try and show you that new content as quick as I possibly can. Sometimes I manage to show you in the first minute of the of the update coming. Sometimes it can be within a couple of hours, but I do always try my best to try and show you the updates as quick as I can. And then after this stream, I drop another video of buying all the sunglasses. Um, there will be new missions when the new lake comes, yeah, and I will be doing I will be making mission videos of that separately. But yeah, no new missions as of yet. It's going to take so much longer. Ugh, come on. It used to frustrate me a little bit when I used to fight the fish and it was kind of stubborn and I just couldn't, couldn't reel it in. Yeah, it did frustrate me. But this happening with the line running, I don't know, I don't think that's as bad as it not running. And it's just stuck in that one spot. I think it's not as bad. But that is really, really going to be hard work now. Man, that sucks taking forever. It does, man. It really does take forever now. It's such a shame. Now, everything in this update is awesome apart from that. Literally everything apart from that. And when it runs that long, 
I wouldn't mind if it runs that long just for the bigger fish, which obviously that is going to be the way. But if you're a lower level and you don't have a very good rod and you're in a different lake and you're fishing, it's going to take you so long to reel in a fish around about five, ten pound. It's going to be it's going to be a little bit silly. Now, if I take these rods and go catch fish around about 20, 30 pounds, it's not going to run. I'll be okay to just reel it in. But anything above 50 pound, it's going to take a short minute. It's going to be very consuming on time. The grind's going to be so much longer now. I'm glad that I made a lot of cash on the game when I did. <laughs> I'm glad I did. 106 pound, and look how long that took. Who's going to play competitions now? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Competitions is not going to be... Look at, look at the glasses. I'll take them off again. Look at that. And now I'll put them back on. That is an amazing update. Very, very good. They've done really well. Again, these are the, the mid-range glasses. Later on today, I'll make a video on the cheaper glasses. And then also in that video, we'll show these glasses again. And then I will also buy the very best glasses and we'll compare them and see which ones look better. Look into the sun. I, I was trying to do that. I can't really see. I think it's over this way. We're going to go jump to the next day and um, maybe it might be a bit clearer. They do look really good though, don't they? They definitely done a good job on that. They said they've been coming. The sunglasses were meant to be coming for so long, and when they take that long to bring out an update, and it ends up turning out to be that good, I don't mind waiting that little bit longer. To wait that little bit longer to make it look that little bit better. It looks so. It does look so good. That is so different. And the good thing about it as well is, as I said, a lot of people always used to say that the, the graphics does suck on this game. And I, it's not bad. It's not brilliant, but it's not bad. On PC, on the other hand, the picture quality is definitely a lot better. Now those sunglasses are there, that makes it even more better. But it's so much more precise look for casting. Uh, that is so much more precise. Again, when I used to use the controller, it always used to I move left or right, and it kind of moved like that a little bit. After I finish moving it, you'll get like a little scroll. But now, now it doesn't. So that is, I love that. I don't know if I like that better or, or the sunglasses better. I'm not sure which one I like better. I can't make up my mind. <laughs> uh, I really can't choose. That's so much more precise for casting. I'm looking forward to making that video later though. Well, I'll, as I said in the same video, I'll, um, I'll buy the other glasses. I'll buy the other glasses and then we'll make a video of just all three glasses together. I'm pretty sure the most expensive ones are going to be the ones that are a little bit better, but we, we can we can try, see what happens though. Alright, so I'm going to put on this one, I'm going to put on some shiners, and I'm going to cast it right out there. Probably not the best of idea, because I've only got... You are going to need a lot more line on your rods now, just because of the fact that they can, they can go that little bit more on running. But I'm going to cast that right out there, you go, that's max cast, how far is that going to take us? That is insane cast. 325 feet. Oh my jeez. <laughs> that is a far cast. Oh my gosh. Alright, so on there we have the we have the Waggler extra heavy. And then the other one. What was the other one? Oh, it was here, wasn't it? In here. Yeah, then you got the slider heavy. That's also a new thing. But the slider heavy. It, it can't get the distance. It can't get the distance as far as um, as far as that one. So 
That's really good though. That is some serious distance. Instead of always being on a boat, if you wanted to reach over, say, to that spot and the heavy chaser can't make it, the float rod is probably worth getting there. Now I know normally with the with the cart rods, with the cart rods, you can you can get some really good distance on the cart rods. The cart rods are good. I like the cart rods. You can get some distance on them. But for a float rod to get that far, that is really, really good. Okay, that's not a very big fish, so it means we're not going to fight it for 10 minutes. I think that's unique, though. Oh, it's not quite. I'm about to rank up as well. Not that rank means anything to me, but... It gives me that extra couple of more bait coins and right now for the fact I gotta spend my own real money. <laughs> Every bait coin I can get I would take. Here we go. This is a big fish. This is where it's gonna be it's gonna be so time consuming. Oh hold on. It might not be it might not be too big, so I might be able to reel it in quicker. Good luck feeling a fish in the distance, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, I don't know. We'll see if we get any interest on it. We'll see what happens. It being cast out that far. Yeah, it's going to take a short minute, isn't it, for sure. This one did seem kind of easy to reel in, and then on this last little bit, I can now, I just can't stop it running anymore. It's going to take so much longer to fill that net. And that's obviously why they did it. That's, good. that's a big fish on there as well. <clears throat> wow, look at it run. I want the float rod to go off more than anything. I want to see how well the float rod does being that far out. And they said about bringing new reels as well. New reels that are going to be able to hold more line. And that's why. That's why. So that way you don't end up keep de-spooling. There's always a reason for everything. And that's obviously... That's obviously the reason. Come on, let's walk towards it. We got it. 62 pounds. That long, 62 pounds. Jeez. Oh no, I picked up the wrong rod. What am I doing? Why do you always feel so relaxed when watching this game? It's a really chilled game, man, isn't it? It's really chilled. That's why I like really... Like, I do like playing other games. Funny enough, I was actually talking to BRS last night. And um, talking about maybe doing some more 7 Days to Die again. And, yeah, I was chatting with him. And he said to me, you know, that those fishing games that you play, he said, it's not really a game that I would do, but... It's actually, it's not, yeah, I actually kind of like it. It's quite chilled. Like I, I do love playing those games where you're driving around at about 4 million miles an hour. And I obviously like showing new games that come out. I like that, but... That obviously shoot, shooting games... I'm, I don't mind shooting games, but... They're alright. But here... When you're, when you're playing this game, you can just... You can be so much more chilled, man. I'm on my way back, back home, in the van. Got a low battery. Yes, there. <laughs> All right, dots. No worries. Okay. Here we got a fish on this long, long cast. Uh, it's not a big fish, so it's not going to pull me out as much as what I thought it would have done. Yeah, seven days to die. Yeah, night. Yeah, you said that it was stable now. Yeah. Oh, 
don't forget everyone to subscribe when them updates come out for fishing planet i do try my best to always try and tell you about those updates as they come even before the updates hit i try and tell you about the updates coming i always try and show you all new stuff we always try and show all new lakes new hot spots rods reels tackle all that good stuff welcome back again jane look at that we caught that from right over there i wouldn't have thought we would have had it on shiners though I need that one more fish and then we're, we're going to rank up. So I'll take the glasses off just to show you guys. That's without them. And then putting them back on. So then we're going to make a video after this stream of all three pairs of glasses. I'm going to make a separate video of all three of them in one video. So you guys can make up your mind on what pair of glasses that you like better. I'm going to spend my real cash to show you that. It's just, oh no, I was meant to cast that one really far, I forgot. Alright, we'll, we'll do that. Have to go, it's my PS4. Um, I'm not sure about tomorrow, I don't know what I'm going to be doing tomorrow. I'm not sure, I am going to be streaming, but... Uh, the new Project Cars 3 is a new game that's come out, a new racing game. And Big Man wanted me to make a video of that. So I'm not sure if we're going to be playing Fishing tomorrow. Normally we do obviously play Fishing Planet every day of the week. But yeah, I'm not sure whether I'm going to be doing some of that tomorrow. I'm going to have to just wait and see really. I don't know. I haven't spoke to Big Man. I did, I did send Big Man a message today and he didn't reply. So I don't know. Yeah, I'm not sure. I have no idea until tomorrow, man. Sorry. going to get drenched riding back home. Speak to you soon. Wish me luck. When get, with getting drenched. Well. Good luck, Dots. <laughs> I thought it was just thinking, oh, okay, yeah, it's raining now. That's funny, because you said it was raining where you were, Trippy, and I said it's only cloudy here. Yeah, now it is raining. Nah, a, water, a bit of water can't hurt you, Dots. This project... Uh, Project Cars is a pretty good game, yeah. It, you obviously got to, if you're into driving games, so then that makes it even better. Look how much, I love the position of casting. It's so much better for casting. That is an awesome, an awesome update that. But yeah, casting is definitely a lot more smooth. That is for sure. I noticed a massive difference in that. And yeah, Project Cars... I played Project Cars, that was okay. I didn't really play much of Project Cars 2, but Big Man did. But the Project Cars 3, he's been playing a little bit of it, and he said that it looks absolutely insane. So, we'll have to, yeah, we'll just wait really, and if he, if he does want to show it, then we'll show that tomorrow. If not, then we'll have more Fishing Planet. I'm happy to play this game every day of the week, if I'm honest. I would, yeah, I wouldn't mind just, um... I wouldn't mind just keep playing this game non-stop, but for me to keep doing that, <laughs> I have to keep making different types of content. If I don't, as a streamer, I will not, I will not be able to grow. That's why I have to play different games. But I do love this game, though, hands down, the best fishing simulator game I've ever played. Stop raining here now, so the rain's moved from you to me. It shifted its way. <laughs> I love it when it rains. I've even done that sometimes. I've actually just gone out in the rain. Just There's, like I not I don't need to go anywhere or do anything, but I just go out in the rain just for just because just because I can. That might sound strange. In fact, saying it, hearing it, <laughs> it does sound a bit strange. But I like it. I do like the rain. I want to try and get a good sized fish on this spinning rod and see see if the line pulls out like that as well. I'm pretty sure it is going to. I want to see if the line pulls out. We'll see. It, it did say that it's a, they were going to add it so it drags. The fish can drag you out. So 
So the fact that it says that, I'm pretty sure it's going to be like that for every single rod that you now use. Oh, I pressed the wrong button and missed that fish. You even had some thunder. Always worried about my PC in weather like that. Are oh, you? Yeah? I don't really. I don't ever think about it, man, to be honest. <clears throat> the thunder and lightning even me being on my electric bike outside man I just yeah I don't think about it, it don't, the thunder and lightning really don't bother me in any way I just uh, oh, I can't bring it back up now never mind That's really good though. I love them sunglasses. So normally we do stream anything from a minimum of around about two and a half hours. Can be up to three, four hours, five, six hours, depending on if everyone's having a good time. That normally does make me stream that little bit longer. I think my longest stream was probably around about 12, 12 hours-ish or just over. <laughs> so the stream subtypes Sometimes they're not too long, sometimes they are. But I am gonna need to I am gonna need to cut this one shorter. Just because I wanna make that separate video. I wanna make one video that I can upload today of buying all three pairs of glasses, showing each glasses one after the other, so we can see the difference. Because I have no idea what the other glasses are gonna be like. I'm trying to speed reel this one. Kind of hard to do. Luckily, the fish isn't too big, so. And we've got a cat. Hmm, that's a big fish on that rod. This one looks like a small fish. The rod next to it looks like a small fish as well. Gotta love that. What an absolute wet boot that was. Let's check this one. Okay, there you go. This one's not too big. This is not gonna take long. Speed reel. Well, wow, that was a little bit in your face. A unique piranha. Sorry, I'm not sharing it very long. It is just because I'm trying to not lose that fish. <laughs> oh. Nobody saw that. Don't worry, nobody saw that. Do you know, if I start playing on computer, if you are able to transfer your account from console, uh... Well, for me, no. They might have changed that now, though. There's a possibility they could have changed it. But yeah, what I do, what I know of, they, you can't do that. But I tried to do that a long time ago. I did, I did try a long time ago to do that. So maybe, possibly now they could have changed it. But I'm not going to give you any false hope, man. I don't think you can. Which is a pain. That's why I've started this game. Four different accounts I've had by playing Fishing Planet. Four different accounts. And that's because just... Yeah. I, I tried um, my old Steam account. I ended up getting rid of that Steam account. Because I lost the password. Couldn't sign back into it. So I had to create another account again. And then for the PS4, the same thing happened. It signed me out of PlayStation Network one time. I forgot the password, couldn't sign back in. So I've started this game from the beginning. I've started this game from the beginning four times. And maxed out level three, max level three times over. The grind is real. I just can't stop it from running. That's what's going to take so much time. So normally I would drop a video after I've done a stream. Normally I drop a video between 5, anything between 5 and 6 p.m. So today I'm probably going to do the same. It'll probably be around, probably closer to the 6 p.m. mark. 
that's uh, UK time for me. So anything within within around about two hours from now, I gotta make a video. I've gotta edit the video. I gotta buy the bait coins, and then get it uploaded within two hours. So wish me luck. It could end up coming a little bit later than 6 p.m. Thinking about it, it could be a little bit longer than two hours. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Maybe I should jump on the boat. Jump on the boat, we drive around. I'll take the sunglasses on and off a few times. Just so we, we can see different different types of views from it. I definitely want to see them other sunglasses though. Buying the expensive ones and then buying the cheaper ones. And then the mid, mid range ones that we have now. I really want to see the difference between them. Let me skip time forward. See if we can get a bit more sun. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's try that. Oh, wow. Look at that. Okay, so taking the sunglasses off. Oh, no. You're not able to take them off. Your hands are busy. Oh, okay. <laughs> Am I, let's slow it down then. Let's go up like this. Okay, that, that's with sunglasses. And without. That really makes a big difference. Not only the sun, the clouds, but even looking at the water. Looking at the water first. Look at that. Wow. And then looking up at the sun. Putting them on. That looks beautiful. They done such a good job. That definitely is so much better. I'm really looking forward to making that video later because if these glasses are that good by buying the better glasses, the more expensive glasses, maybe maybe they could even look even better than than what we see right now. Technically it should look better because we're spending more bait coins. But I'm I'm really impressed with that. I really am impressed with that. They've done such a good job. And look on the boat. It says it's got a picture of that man. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Picture of the man. And it says one out of one. One out of one. That means that eventually they could end up letting other people get in the boats. There's a possibility, you know. Maybe they might. Do what? In the inventory? Go to the little green guy. Yeah. Above the rod stand. You want to, you want to, you want about um, that. That is for, you can put ground bait, make up ground bait, put it in your hand, and you can throw ground bait out. If that's what, if that's what you want about. A lot of people ask me that. A lot of people actually, it's quite surprising how many people don't know that. But yeah, if you make up some ground bait, you don't have to have a rod spot. If you make up some ground bait, you can put it into that slot, and then when you're in that slot. When, when she, well, it automatically, well, you can drag it over and put it into that spot. When it puts it into there, and then you know where you would normally get your rod. You choose your rod. Well, it will come up a picture of the ground bait on a hand. And then you can throw the ground bait out with your hand. Yeah, not many people know that. These sunglasses, man. That's why they always... We, I was always thinking, why are they taking so long? And that is why. That's definitely why it took so long. Even the sun. Look at looking at just the sun. It looks like it goes smaller. It almost looks like it goes a little bit further away in, in the dis, dis, like in the distance. I don't know. It does. Yeah, it does kind of look like it goes further away.
Discovery DLC. Oh, okay. Let me have a look at the DLC then. Um, okay, so where's there? Discovery. So yeah, you get some credits and bait coins. Not enough bait coins. Mm. Yeah, that's expensive though. I don't have enough bait coins. But yeah, I guess. Yeah, it does work out cheaper, doesn't it? I think. Rather than buying them separately. Let's have a look. Uh, we, we're glitching a little bit. Let's go back. There we go. Yeah. I guess it's worth it. Is that 100 and... I don't know though, because it says 175.00. So is it 175 bait coins or 175,000? Like it couldn't be 175,000. There's no way. It must be, yeah, it must be 175. I don't know, though, because 175 bait coins, that costs more than 175. And it couldn't be 175,000 because just buying those glasses would be cheaper. So I think it's kind of glitched out for me a little bit for that. It could be glitched out. I think it is glitched. Yeah, I think it is. I think it is 175 bait coins, but it's just kind of weird how. Comes up when you just start fishing planet. Yeah, I did see it pop up here. Yeah. I should have really done that. I should have done that. I made I made a big mistake. It's all right. That that them mistakes that I make means that you guys don't make. I think yeah, 230 bait coins. I brought them ones. So I could have got all of them. It ended up costing me more. That's normally the way it is with me, though. I get I get like a kid when I'm playing this game, man. I get <laughs> I get so hyped up, and I just rush into buying things. Uh, let me quickly buy some bait coins. Give me a second. Let's buy some bait coins. I'm gonna change the screen because obviously I don't want you guys seeing my my details. Let's buy some bait coins. The amount of money I spend on this game is insane. Oh, I, in some way I would like to know how much I've spent, but in some way I wouldn't. I've spent so much money on this game. It's worth it though. It's good for it's good for you guys. I get to show it, and it's good for me as well because it also gives me that content. But it's not cheap. Okay, return to your transaction. 600 bait coins. Authorize. <clears throat> okay, there we go. I just brought 600 bait coins. So now I got tw uh, 726. So the reason why I brought that many, I could have brought like. A lower amount but there's not really much point because I'm always spending my real money anyway buying bait coins so when we do play this game I'm able to jump the days forward okay bye so yeah 175 yeah purchase the discovery kit closed so is that gonna be here or it's probably gonna be in my home storage isn't it That is going to be in my home storage, I'm very sure of it. Mm. Does that mean the... I, I'm not sure. I think they probably will do it like that, where you can end up buying 
buying them with cash. At the minute, it's not, but I'm pretty sure you can. All right, let's go back to the... Um... All right, Eric, no worries, man. Thanks for dropping by. Enjoy the rest of your day or evening or night, whatever it is for you. Let's, let's quickly go back and have a look at that pack that we just brought. Well, yeah, I didn't really plan on spending money, but it's, it's all right, though. At least we do have some more bait coins. I'm always going to need bait coins anyway, so bait coins is always going to be a thing. Okay, and close. That chat thing there, I don't like the idea that that keeps on staying there. Can I remove it from like that? No, I can't remove it. I don't know if that's bugged or... Yeah, global, 71 people. Yeah, I don't know why I, I can't remove it. Let me have a look at this, zoom it out. There's so much more space. For them to add so many more things like up here the amount that they've got around there they could put so many different different lakes and different whatever other different places to fish on here that's quite a big space there now let's go into the inventory home storage so is either going to be as a pack or did it unpack itself i don't know we'll see Okay, let's keep going. There you go. Glasses classic. Glasses fish hunter. Glasses spider. So we've already got the fish hunter ones. It was called fish hunter, wasn't it? Yeah, okay. So we've already got the fish hunter ones. So let me put that into the home storage. Um start from there okay now wasn't there where was it there we go so we got we got two of these now so I don't need them both so I could sell one how much it give 646 not very much <laughs> but I don't need them both though it's 46 46 yeah okay I get rid of I get rid of one pair because I don't need the same pair it's kind of silly to have two of the same but yeah, at least now we got the classic ones. It's I messed up big time because I rushed into it. I ended up paying two hundred for these, and yeah, I kind of got all three of them for one seventy-five. <laughs> yeah, nobody saw that. <laughs> nobody saw that. All right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna end there just because I really want to get that new video out is what I'm going to do is I'm going to make a video and in the same video we're going to show each pair of those glasses and um, yeah we'll make a video and we'll see which pair of glasses look the best so that way you guys don't end up buying a certain pair and there's a pair that is better don't do what I did and brought, brought that um, one for 200 <laughs> don't buy the same as me you can buy all three for 175 bait coins but nobody saw that, so we're all good. It's all right. <laughs> yeah, you thought I could have got them cheaper. It's because I'm like a kid, man. I am literally like a big kid. When these new updates come out, I rush into it. I get so excited, and it always costs me more money. I did it with Maku Lake as well, and I did it with Blue Crab. I end up buying separate little things, then end up buying the proper thing, and it costs me more money. It, it comes out of my pocket, so at least you guys can kind of just sit there and laugh at it. And um, yeah, it costs me more. <laughs> but I'm going to make another video. If I can, I try to get it out by six. If I can't, it might be a little bit later. But I make a video on all of those sunglasses, showing all three pairs. And I put that into one video, and we'll see. And you guys can always leave in comments which ones you like better. I'm glad to show you this update. And. Um, yeah, quite a surprise that it just appeared. So yesterday, uh, yesterday, oh my gosh, tomorrow, I'm not sure if we're going to be on Fishing Planet or whether we're going to be showing some project cards free. I'll see what Big Man's doing and 
yeah, we'll, we'll just see what happens. But we do stream this game a lot. Don't forget to drop a like if you guys did enjoy this one. Subscribe if you're new when them updates come out. I do try my best to try and show you the updates as quick as I possibly can. If there's any information on updates, I always try and tell you that as well. So yeah, drop a like, subscribe, turn notifications on. We catch you people again soon for some more fun and games. I'm out.